This one is more about chemistry and, and people working together and collaborating. And it comes from like being friends. And me and Joe, uh, we, we've been friends for years. And you know, a lot of her extended family are my friends, and a lot of my friends are her friends. And um, there are a lot of DJs and musicians. And we were, we're in sister-in-laws at some point. Yeah, we just, we were. <laughs> it's true. We were uh, sister-in-laws for for a brief period of time. <laughs> the idea of Operation Juliet is like different band members from different styles of music. You have classical music. Um, we did things with, you know, Mark, your husband, and spank rock that's mm -hmm. rapping and all kinds of very different things. And then Yeah came, Mimi and Sean had a dinner at the house and all our friends were there and everybody was jamming and we said, oh, it would be really cool if you can take that and put it on stage and just recreate it. It was like everybody together and it was super fun. Um, it's fun because we do songs from everybody in the different bands. We all kind of play together too. I'm not really a musician. I, I mean, for me, it's more, right, I like writing more. Joe and, and Alexander, they're more technical and very musical and, you know, the melodies and um, the songs are beautiful. So, I, you know, it's nice because I learn a lot from them. And Mark made a really good description of her. He said she was a mix between, when she started singing, she was, she was a mix between Patti Smith and Charlie Chaplin. <laughs> I thought it was so great. She starts moving her feet in the most crazy way and like dancing around. She actually looks like Charlie Chaplin, but she has like a deep voice that would kind of recall Patty Smith, remind you of Patty Smith. I was like, that's so funny. She was wearing like a little tuxedo and her, she had like short hair. She like, we met through a mutual friend of ours. And, uh, and yeah, and I think we became friends like in like two Instantly. minutes, like instant. She is one of my favorite people in the world. She's got like the best sense of humor. And uh, yeah, in every situation, it's like she becomes like this character. So she's got like funny stories and accents, and she makes everybody feel very comfortable. As any situation becomes quite magical, just walking to the streets of Paris, she gets excited. She like. Kind of starts climbing a wall and then like shows you a little statue that's hanging there and then she like starts <laughs> dancing around. Apparently like 90% of uh, humans communicating is a uh, sign language. So, so it would be interesting because then when you speak the same language, it, 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 you don't even have to. It doesn't have to be like a language, but it would be like somebody that's a little bit kind of like you. So you don't have to say anything, they'll understand. So it's enough. It's enough. <laughs>